Hello everyone. This is Prashanta. Uh, welcome to Python Automation Learning Series. So today we are going to see the very important topic, Python inheritance. What is inheritance? So inheritance is allowing us to create a new class from a another class to inheriting all the properties of one class to another class. So that is the biggest advantage of inheritance. Okay. So first of all, how to create a class? So in previous class, we we taught how to create a class, how to create an object. If you missed out, please go and watch it. I'm going to create a class, class keyword and class name. I'm going to create a employee. That is a class. Okay. So in this, I'm going to create a one con constructor. Like how to create a constructor? Dev, double hyphen, init, double hyphen. So in this, I'm going to create two variables. One is employee name and employee role number. So on and things, I'm going to create two declare two variable. One is self dot employee. mp equal to name like i'm going to assign employee name and i'm going to create another variable emp role number equal to emp role number so we created a two variables so i'm going to get one method inside the so i'm going to create a def get details so in this method i'm going to print self dot employee name and another method i am going to print the self dot employee role number okay let's see this this is one method so i am going to get a first child class so in a employee i am going to get a first class so first class like qa so qa is the one department so how how to inherit one class to another class simply we need to copy the class name and we need to provide in the circle bracket So this is how simple we can able to create a employee like uh, inheriting the one class to another class. So here also I'm going to create a one constructor. So in this constructor, I have a, my parent have a two parameter and I have one another dep one department is my parameter. Okay. So and I need to have the, at the same time I need to have my parents constructor variable as well. So first thing I need to. create a variable for myself like self dot department equal to department and we need to send to the parent these two things so so what is my parent name employee so my parent class dot init so i need to pass to my parent self so i want to want to pass two things what are things employee name and i want to pass the employee role number okay here i am creating one another variable like method this method will get show the get department so it will print the get department for this class so i'm going to create print a one method print method in the print method i'm going to create self dot a department okay how cool is so this is the first class okay so like one first child so i'm going to create a same i'm going to get my second child so this child i am keep like a dev see here so what are the advantage of inheritance So first thing, code reusability. See this, I'm using the same only uh, this code only, but this class also using this code. This class also using this code. So what is code reusability? We are using same things and maintenance. What is maintenance? Suppose tomorrow I'm uh, I want to change any update or anything is coming. I only want to update the parent class because this whatever changing I'm doing in a parent class will it will reflect in the child class. So maintenance also very highest advantage of the inheritance. So in uh, we are start of a previous class. Class the blueprint. It won't do anything until you create an object. So I'm creating good object like I'm creating OBJ one. So this project, this object I'm going to create for QA class. So QA. So I want to pass three parameters. What are the parameters for inheritance? I want to pass a department. I want to pass the employee name, and I want to pass a role number. So first thing is department. I'm putting like he is the automation department. Okay, automation and employee name is Ram, and then I'm telling like he is one. His role number is one. So I am using this object one. I am printing get details. See, see here. What is the advantage of inheritance? So the get detail is like a method of employee class. But right now I am calling using the QA class. How? Because this QA class is inherited the parent class employee. So that's why I am able to use the parent method. So and I am going to call another method. So that method is get. department okay so in the same way i am going to create a 
another object this time i'm going to create for the so this is i'm going to create for a dev okay this is i will tell he is a developer then his name is kumar so his role number is i tell like two then i am changing the true object two so i'm out how to run a class right click run as the file name to so see this it's printed rom the roll number on the department and its second object is kumar roll number on the department okay so this are the advantage of inheritance if you have any doubts please put me in the comment if you like this video please subscribe and share to your friends thanks for joining